Hello, I'm Keith, and this is my dad, Carolyn. Welcome back to another episode of Father and Son Star Wars Podcast. Thank you for joining us again for another episode and we thought we'd do something a little different we we're right. going to talk about what's in our star wars collection we're going to start with comic books then real books and finally some of the toys right okay so let's get started all right let's start with the comic books that we have i've been collecting star wars comic books for a while and one series that i recommend is a four-part series called star wars shattered empire and it actually takes place right after Return of the Jedi. And just when you thought that the Empire was defeated, there's still a small group of Imperials that are existing that need to be found. Uh, so Luke, Han, and Leia, you know, the rest of the team, they're all there, uh, ready to stake out whatever uh, the Empire has in store for them. You know? right. So the Empire is not completely gone. And then what's also nice about this series is that it introduces two new characters, Shara right. Bay, and Kess Dameron, now if you remember the, the last name, they actually become the parents of Poe Dameron from the sequel trilogy. Right. All right. And uh, another series I like to uh, talk to you about, which I think is excellent, it's a 25 part series, Dark Vader uh, series written by Charles Soule. It came out in 2017. This is just uh, issue number 14. This came out again in 2017, and this takes place between. Uh, Revenge of the Sith and A New Hope. And this is Darth Vader just trying to figure out, okay, well, what's my role in the Empire? What does the Emperor have in store for me? Um, and that's what we, he goes through in this episode where he's working with uh, the Inquisitors. Uh, they're still trying to search for any Jedi that had survived Order 66. So it's a very good series. I highly recommend that. All right. And then the last comic book I want to recommend is this graphic novel. This is Darth Maul, son of Dathomir. This, this is a, a six issue series that was actually uh, created with unproduced screenplays from the Clone Wars. So they were supposed to create this as a Clone War, as Clone Wars episode, but they were unproduced. So they decided to create a comic book series instead. So I didn't know that. Yeah, it's probably difficult to find the six issues. But if you are looking for this, you're probably better off finding the graphic novel. So this is it. So this is Darth Maul, Son of Dathomir. Okay. All right. So let's start with what you have. You have some books over there. Yep. First one is Adventures of Wild Space. So this was written by uh, two authors, uh, mm -hmm. Kevin Scott and Tom Huddleston. Mm. There's seven books in the series. This is the second book. Mm -hmm. And actually, I started, I read the first book. Yeah. And I really enjoyed the first book. I didn't get a chance to get into the rest of the series, but I highly recommend it. And not only do you read these books over and over, you also uh, yes, listen to the audio. Yes, there's an audible audio. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. What else? Then there's Ahsoka. I've I've read this at least a thousand times. Yeah. And also listened to the audiobook 2,000 times. There you go. There you go. So it's e. K. written Johnston. by E.K. Johnston. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very good. And this takes place right after the Clone Wars, correct? Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. So this is Ahsoka on a journey. Um, I, I believe she takes on, uh, she uh, has an undercover uh, assignment where she's working with people. She doesn't want them to know where she's from, that she is a Jedi. But it's a very intriguing book. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. And then there's some comedy, the Jedi okay. Academy series. Jedi Academy. Yeah, this was written by actually three authors. Like the first three books was written by Jeffrey Brown. The second, the second, like the fourth and the fourth through sixth books mm -hmm. were written by Derek Kozaska. And then the last three books were also written by Jared Krasowski in collaboration with another author. Wow, a lot of authors. Uh, okay. And how, how, do you remember how many 
books are in this series? The Jedi Nine Academy? total. Nine in total. Okay. Plus, like, I think there were either one or two extras. Right. And you highly recommend this book for uh, yes. kids your age to read. Yes. It's very funny. Okay. And while we're on books for kids my age, mm -hmm. there's also the Origami Yoda series. Okay. Origami Yoda. Right. Written by Tom Engelberger. Okay. And is there something you could tell us about this book? You recommend it? Yes. <laughs> okay. All right. Before you get to that book, can I just show you a couple of novels that I recommend? Yep. Uh, one is, this is called Star Wars Bloodline by Claudia Gray. Claudia Gray is one of the premier um, authors of Star Wars. She writes some very, very good books. Now, this book is a, it's a political drama. So if you know someone who's into politics and they're into Star Wars, this is the perfect book for them. I think they would enjoy this book. But this takes place a few years before The Force Awakens. And the New Republic has formed. Leia, at the moment, has a senator's position, but she's actually um, looking to uh, get elected to a higher position. But she's carrying a secret. And if the secret is found out by the New Republic, that can mean the end of her political career. So it's actually a very good book I recommend. And then I have another novel. This is called Star Wars Reborn, Resistance Reborn by Rebecca Roanhorse. This takes place immediately after, okay, this takes place immediately after uh, The Last Jedi. At the end of the movie, if you remember, the, the resistance is down to a handful of people. So what they're doing between The Last Jedi and The Rise of Skywalker is trying to recruit some people to help them defeat the First Order. Right. Okay. All right. And what, then what I else do you have there? Another book, you know, Star Wars, The High Republic. It's been on display since, I think, the first or third episode. Mm -hmm. I'll, show, I'll pull the book up. Yeah. This yep. is from the new... Star Wars books that are coming out. They actually started yep. coming out this year. Um, so this uh -huh. is part of the High Republic series. And yeah, this the is the one version. for right for children, right? And uh -huh. this is the author is Justina Ireland. Yeah. Right? Okay. Another book I highly you highly recommend. Right. Okay. And then my last book mm -hmm. is Ultimate Lego Star Wars. Mm -hmm. You See? are a big Legos fan. Oh, I love anything that has the word Lego in it. There you go. Okay. So this just explains the different, uh, sorry, this is the different characters yes. and different locations that are different variations that, of you, characters. that can be created with these Lego figures, correct? Yeah. Wow. This is very cool. Right. So let's we'll see if we can see some of them. Oh, look at that. That's the Death Star. Right? Yeah. So that's pretty cool. Right. So this is a that's huge the new book. One. Right. Okay. And speaking of huge books, let's talk about reference books. So, you know, when we're preparing for the podcast, you know, we may have some you know, need some answers to some questions that we have, and we have some reference books that will really help us out. One that we highly recommend is called The Ultimate Star Wars. This is yeah, a new edition. Yes, this is a new edition. This covers the entire Skywalker saga from right. episode one to episode nine and, and everything in between. Uh -huh. It also covers like the offshoot, like Solo and Rogue One and stuff. Clone Wars. And yeah, it covers that too. And Star Rebels. Wars, Rebels, Star Wars Resistance. It just right. doesn't have the Mandalorian. Right. And I'm a big fan of the original trilogy. And I like the behind the scenes work of, you know, the making of the Star Wars film. So I have these three own books. <laughs> They're pretty large. Um, they're, they're huge. Do yeah. Help so, us? yeah. So hold this one. This is Return of <laughs> Jedi. Okay, so this is books. This is heavy. This is a coffee table book. This is uh, by J.W. Rinsler. And what they are are the making of Star Wars, right? So there's one for each of the original series Star Wars. And then you have one for Empire Strikes Back, which is this one. And it starts, it, it takes you from pre-production to release of the film. And credits, reviews. It really covers everything. It is all inclusive. I highly recommend these books. If you're into something where, you know, where you want to know the behind the scenes, you know, how scenes are shot and how they decide on the dialogue that they're going to use and the last minute writing and the secrets that they've been trying to keep while making these films. And this is Return of the Jedi. I, a I, heavy one. This is a heavy one. Yes. I highly recommend that. Okay. Uh, and then, else to share? Yeah, I actually have one more book. Now, let's say if you are new to Star Wars and you don't know where to start, 
what book would you want to read? Well, this is what I recommend for you. So if you wanted to know about the Skywalker Star Wars, it's important to know about the Skywalker saga. And the Skywalker saga is a family, right? That starts with Anakin Skywalker. It begins with Anakin Skywalker and it ends, uh, it goes from episode one, when we first meet Anakin Skywalker, up until episode nine, The Rise of Skywalker, and everything in between. So what this book does, this is by Christina Braver, um, it captures all of anything related to Anakin, Luke, Leia. They cover the comic books, they cover other novels. So it's just an all-inclusive book. And if you want to learn Star Wars, this is where I would I would start. So I right. completely recommend this book. And it's Christina, Christina Baver, not Braver, Christina Baver, Skywalker, the Family at War. Wonderful. Right. Okay. All right. And now, it feels. Yes, let's talk about the toys. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Here we have this TIE fighter. Right. This like is cool. The Hasbro sets, it's mm -hmm. from 2003. But if you use the Hasbro set minifigures, mm -hmm. you could actually fit one like inside of the TIE fighter. Mm, okay. Can you open, like, show us again and open up the flap where yeah. the, the figure would go in? See, they'd go in here. Gotcha. Okay. That's pretty cool. And you only you can only fit one, right? Well, you can't fit two. You can't fit one. Okay. okay. In fact, I think TIE fighters are one seaters in general. Gotcha. That makes sense. Of course they are, right? And you know, like we already said, we know that you are a huge Star Wars fan and you're a huge Lego fan. As yeah. Well. And since you were the age of four. No, you've been you know, creating Yeah, I started these making Lego. Legos in 2015. Right, you've been putting these Lego sets together. So what we've done, because there's so many and we don't have time to show it to you here, if you go to our Instagram page, you'll see some photos of uh, Keith over the years putting together some of Lego models. You know, right. it's very fascinating, very cool. And that is it. All uh, right. Yeah. Oh, Dad, don't, don't forget to talk about your soundtracks and stuff. No, we don't have three hours to talk about soundtracks. You know. Okay. Let's just, you know, we'll wrap this up. Yeah. Um, again, this is, you know, some ideas, some summer reading. If you're interested in getting into uh -huh. Star Wars, uh, you're looking for a gift for that Star Wars fan, we hope we inspired you to find something. Right. Mm -hmm. Now you can find us on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Stitcher, Radio Public, Audible, Amazon Music, and wherever you get your podcast, what are you doing? Oh, this is a, a soundtrack. Okay. It's a it's a record album. What's a record? Oh, okay. I, I forgot. You don't know about records. I'll explain to you after the podcast. Yep. Okay. okay. <clears throat> we also have a Facebook page. Look for us under Father, Son, and SW Podcast. And then we also have the Instagram page. Look for KTR podcast, all lowercase, no spaces. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Uh, and, and we have a YouTube page. So please subscribe. If you know people who are interested in Star Wars, who you Just think would be interested in our podcast, them. bring them over to us. Uh -huh. uh, and you can also find us on Instagram. Once again, you take a look at Keith's photos right. and uh, uh, like our page on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. Okay. So that is it, ladies and gentlemen. So thank you very much for this special episode. Um, we'll take care. We'll see you again. Bye.